Come around, got the whole thing wobbing. What is going on YouTube? Once again, I'm here back on NBA Live Mobile. Today is September 1st, which means we got a massive content haul here in NBA Live Mobile Season 8. We're going to start things off with a new Live Pass. So from the Live Pass, we got a new 105 Kevin Garnett. This dude you can actually get for free if you grind out the Live Pass. It's very easy as a no money spent player. All you guys have to do is just grind out your daily objectives every single day. And by the end of the month, uh, you'll be able to add a lot of new rewards to your account. Uh, you can get free NBA cash, you can get free stamina, uh, free boost items, and free players. Uh, this month's free player is the 105 Garnett. He's actually all right, you know what I'm saying? I already have a small forward for my team, so I'm probably not gonna go for him. Uh, we actually got a new Kevin Durant that I'm gonna be adding to the squad. Stay tuned for that. We still got about five days left of that promo. Same with the Shy Gilgis Alexander. I'm actually getting close to getting him as well. Let me know your progress on Polar Playmakers and let me know your progress on the Back to School promo. Today, we're going to be reviewing the new Featured Collection promo for September. We got some new players right here. So uh, it says, check out this month's Featured Collection. Each week features a limited time player for you to add to your lineup. You earn featured points from completing daily objectives and playing Featured Collection events. Spend the points on player fragments, which you can then trade in sets to get this week's Featured Player. So this week's Featured Player is Claxton, all right? He's actually not that good, personally. I'm actually going to be getting him because he is auctionable. This is pretty much the only way to make coins in this game. You grind out the masters, you wait for them to become auctionable, and then you sell them on the auction house. That's how I currently have 11 million coins right now. These coins actually go to good use, so make sure you guys are constantly stacking up your coins uh, throughout the year so that whenever you need them, you can actually use them, all right? So... Let's take a look at this Claxon, and I'm going to show you guys how to get each week's featured collection player. Uh, he only has 91 speed, he only has 90 agility, 96 dribble speed, 98 dribbling. He does have 98 offensive and defensive rebounding, which is alright. My team is filled with a whole bunch of boosts, so a card like this would actually get boosted up nicely. Ooh, excuse me. He gives a post monster boost, which uh, could help you out if you throw him on a bench. Me personally, I prefer to add team wide boost to the bench. If you see the circle, then that means it's just a position boost only. If you see the square, then it is a team wide boost. Like I said, I'm going to be selling this Claxton once I do get him. So, uh, you know, that's another that's another alternative. You don't got to add these players to your team. You can always post them up on the auction block and uh, get your value out of this promo okay he has 97 dunk <clears throat> he has 98 layup 99 inside paint shot 100 scoring with contact he has 99 mid-range when we take a look at the bottom he has 98 contested shot 99 shooting touch 97 shot off dribble 101 block which is nice and uh, 92 on ball defense so the next player we're getting is bob Cousy. he's actually good 105 dunk uh 104 mid-range which is nice 101 speed, he's actually very quick, 100 quickness, and 103 vertical. Week three will feature a Jalen Brown. He has 105 layup, 105 shooting touch, and 106 shot off dribble. And then last but not least, we got a George Gervin. 104 layup, 100 inside paint shot, 101 scoring with contact. He has 101 shooting touch, and 100 shot off dribble, okay? Basically, how you guys get these cards all right, as you go over to uh, limited time events. All right, we're gonna start here. You guys can see when it comes to back to school, we got five total days. I've been grinding. I'm gonna be getting this Kevin Durant no money spent. Let me know your progress on that. And uh, Polar Playmakers, as you guys can see, I still gotta play these events. And I actually have a lot of players that I pulled. I already unlocked the second event. It wasn't too difficult. I have a lot of players that I actually pulled from the first event that I need to quick sell. So let me just do that real quick. We're gonna scroll down here and uh, let me see, did I pass him? Maxi's not it. Let me clean my eyes real quick. Where's he at? I could have sworn I pulled a 98 already. Maybe, maybe I didn't. Here we go, Nesmith. All right, we pulled two of those. 
And then I also pulled a couple of the 95s. Let me see how many I pulled. Am I tripping? I know for, oh, that's what happened. I accidentally exchanged them in the new set. That's what I get. All right, I wasn't paying attention and I accidentally exchanged them in a new set. I'm actually salty because I think I pulled like three of them. It is what it is, I'm gonna have to take the L on that. But when we go over here to sets, okay, let's go over to core, and this is where you're gonna find the featured collection, Nicholas Claxton. We already have 65 fragments. We got these fragments from exchanging 10 85 to 96s into the set. I actually exchanged some of the 95s from Polar Playmakers. Make sure you guys don't make that mistake because I did and I lost out on a lot of icy points that I could have had towards uh, the second event. But I completed this set 13 times. If you complete it 20 times, you can actually claim the Claxton right now. But each time you complete this set, you get five player fragments. And that is how I was able to get 65 fragments out the gate. We only need 35 more to claim this 106 Claxton, which shouldn't be too difficult. Let's hop over here to limited time events and this is how you can get some more of these fragments. This is gonna last one week. We have more than enough time to get this Claxton. We have three events on the right side, all right? This top event gives you 25 feature points each time you do it. It refreshes every, uh, let me see. So this promo came out at 7 a.m. It's about to be noon. So or it may have came out at six, but this event refreshes every 12 hours. So you got 10 events per day that you can uh, knock out. Now these points go towards uh, this chance pack right here. All right, let's click on it. Or actually, I clicked the wrong thing. If we click on it right here, you have a 95% chance at getting an 85 to 96, and you have a 5% chance at actually pulling the 106 Claxton. When we go over here to player fragments, you wanna actually use these points on the player fragments. We're gonna have to basically buy this 35 total times. So from this event right here, you're getting 25. If you do 25 times five, that's 125 times two. You're getting 250 of these every single day. If you do that times seven, you're pretty much getting a, a two, a, my bad. You're getting 1500 by the end. All right, so right here, you're only going to be able to get uh, five total fragments. All right, five total fragments. So a lot of these fragments you're going to get from this event right here. All right, this event also refreshes every 12 hours. So every 12 hours, you're going to be able to get four total fragments times two per day. That's eight. Eight times seven is 56. So by the end of the promo, all right, you're going to be able to get 56 fragments from this event, and then you're going to be able to get five fragments from uh, doing the featured collection warm up. So um, that's a total of 61. So from the sets, you're only going to have to get 39 total fragments just from doing a set. So every single week, it's going to be set up this way. You're just going to have to have the players to uh, throw into the set. You can get the players easily by opening pro packs every day and opening up the monthly master packs every every single time they're available as you guys are grinding these new promos out you're going to be getting a lot of monthly masters points when we when we hop over here to uh i don't know why there isn't a monthly section earn rewards i guess they uh took monthly masters out which is very weird in my opinion but yeah pretty much you want to open up these pro packs every day so that you can stack up these players to throw into the set we only need 35 more fragments to get the Claxton, and we'll be able to easily get that uh, once we get the events done every single day. All right, so like I said, what I would focus on is back to school first. All right, I already finished a lot of the uh, strategic events. You wanna knock out all of the back to school events, and then um, you wanna do featured collection because it does refresh every 12 hours. You should have enough stamina to get both of those done as well as Polar Playmakers. You wanna get your Polar Playmakers events done. I currently have 40,000 points that I could use towards this event right here. So hopefully we could pull the 105 and the 100 overall before we get down to 25,000 points. I'm gonna put 15,000 points towards this event and hopefully we can get both of the players so that we could spend 25,000 points on this event to get this 107 shot. Gilgis Alexander, no money spent. 
all right that's going to wrap it up for this video if you guys did enjoy make sure to click that like button make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time peace